Good evening everybody, this is War Junkie with Terran Team 6. We're an outfit on Jaeger and quite frankly, we kick ass. Anyway, tonight's lesson is going to be how to use TeamSpeak in accordance with Terran Team 6 protocol. Now, here you will notice we have a platoon up and running. We have our commander of the platoon or our platoon leader, uh, D-Rock. He is in the command bridge and we've got a Alpha Squad. There's no Bravo currently it looks like. We've got Charlie Squad and we've got Delta. Now, you will notice in each of these channels there is a squad leader. Well, how do you know there's a squad leader? Simple, Steve. <clears throat> or War Junkie. Uh, because there is someone with the channel command active in the squad. Now, anybody on the server can simply do what I'm about to do and right click their name and activate channel command. Okay, you right click it again to turn it off and you right click it to turn it on. And we're going to turn it off. Now, what channel command does is it allows you to listen to a set uh, channel that only other channel commanders broadcast to. Very, very useful when you are, for example, with Planet Side 2 in charge of a squad and you want to communicate with the squad leader of Charlie, let's say you're in Delta, and McFowl wants to communicate with his fellow squad leaders uh, and his platoon leader, D-Rock, who's in the command bridge, which is a sub-channel of the Platoon 1 main channel. Okay, so everything under Platoon 1, which you can see here, everything indented, is in that respective channel family. Okay, then it goes on to Platoon 2, which starts its own channel family. I'm explaining that to you because we're about to get into that in a little bit. Now, let's start off with the squad leaders and how they want to configure their channel command. As a squad leader, I just want to be able to communicate with everybody in my channel family. I don't want to communicate with every single channel commander across TeamSpeak because I will be jumbling up their comms with squad uh, orders or squad questions or what have you. Terran Team 6 is going to get to the point where we have a second regular platoon, a main element. We're going to have our Terran Dragons, which is our air unit. The Vanguard, which is our shock trooper unit. Recon 1, which is Durr, Recon, and other platoons, so we need to be very organized in how we communicate. So, let me teach you how that's going to work. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Settings. I'm going to click on Options. Here's going to be the Whisper, okay? I'm going to click on Whisper. I'm going to click on Whisper Lists. Okay, once Whisper List comes up, oh, excuse me there, hold tight. Okay, let's see here. Got some stuff up here I don't need. Okay. Okay, so once again, we're going to click on our whisper lists. And this beautiful screen will come up right here. Now, I'm going to remove the ones I have set already. So this is how it's going to look when you first start off. You're going to click on New. You're going to hit any key that you want to use to talk. Do not use your regular push to talk key. These are going to be separate bindings. So I'm going to use, um, let me see, left alt. Okay. You may get a message like this. No problem. Hit OK. So this is what's going to come up. Over here, on, don't worry about reply. Okay. Just the hot key. Whisper 2, you're going to select groups. Group Whisper Type will be Channel Commander. Group Whisper Target will be Complete Channel Family. Complete Channel Family. I'm going to hit Apply and then OK. Now, what this is going to do is this is going to allow me that when I act to do this, when I activate Channel Commander and I'm in, let's say, the Terran Dragon Platoon, I can be in this channel or any, because this is the parent channel, Okay, so I can be in the parent channel or any of its sub channels, and when I use my special push to talk, it is gonna it is going to communicate only with the channel commanders that are in this channel family. Okay, so that's all you need is a squad leader. You need to be able to communicate with your squad using your regular push to talk button. 
okay when you're here and then you're gonna need your uh, channel command active and you're gonna need that special key bind now let's talk about the times when you are thrust into a platoon leader situation and you need to communicate with other platoon leaders who may be on the same objective or who may not be and you need some help now we're gonna go back into our settings we're gonna go into options and once again we're gonna hit our whisper list okay up here we're gonna do new we're gonna press another key I'll use control for the sake of it alright so controls up there again we're not worrying about the reply hotkey whisper two we're gonna go to groups Command, yeah, I am. I'm ahead of Delta. and then we are gonna go into group whisper type which will be channel commander group whisper target hey, so will be so all so channels okay Give it'll be all channels and then once you click on all channels Appreciate you're gonna it. hit apply okay so now you've got two channel command key binds you've got one that when you press it is gonna allow you to speak to only those in your respective channel family which is what you want to do when you're running a squad or you're the platoon leader wanting to talk to your squad leaders okay, okay so when you talk to your squad leaders platoon leaders that's the one you're gonna use you are not gonna use your global uh, channel command com right, okay Charlie, you are not gonna use leader. you are not gonna use the global one alright now as a platoon leader you should be sitting in your command bridge of your channel and issuing orders down the line to your squad leaders as they communicate back to you now as a platoon leader you're probably also gonna need to speak to the platoon leader of platoon one which is any one of these guys sitting in the command bridge okay but you don't necessarily wanna speak to or excuse me you don't want your uh, well when you're speaking to all of the platoon leaders be advised that you're gonna be cutting into these comms as well because everyone on channel command will hear what you're saying so it is imperative that when you're using your global communication that you're quick and fast you're quick and fast and to the point say what you gotta say and that's it that should that channel should not be used as a social channel you shouldn't be joking on global comms now now that we've got all that set let me explain to you what you're gonna say so that people know where you're speaking from if you are using your global push to talk you will say the word global okay you are gonna say global and then your statement it is imperative that you say that because if you do not this guy here is is not gonna know whether you're down here down here he's not gonna know really what's going on but if you use the word global he's gonna know that that is coming from another platoon leader now if you are a squad leader simply trying to speak to your platoon leader or your fellow squad leaders maybe asking for reinforcements you wanna say the word command you're gonna say command and then your statement that way those in your family channel your channel family platoon one which is consists of command bridge alpha bravo charlie and delta that way they know that this is someone local in their local command chain so remember your push to talks and remember at which point you are going to be using them so once again global is what you're gonna say when you wanna communicate with all of the channel commanders across TeamSpeak platoon leaders should be the only ones using this command is what you're gonna say before you speak if you are talking to your local channel family that should be squad leader to squad leader platoon leader to squad leader squad leader to platoon leader if you have any questions shoot junk war junkie a PM in game this is my first video so if I sound like a retard I do apologize and I hate you all let's go out and kick much ass together have a happy damn new year